Good morning guys. Yeah, I stayed in this hotel. It's nice. They have a nice swimming pool at the back and this is how it is. Also the room is nice, very basic but it's cool. And this is my bike. Yeah, at the moment there is no people in the office. So I just leave the key in the key drop. And we are going now. I don't know the name of this golf course but if you check in the Google map, you're going to see this here in Tea Garden, Hawks Nest area. Uh, yeah, we are now leaving the Tea Garden and we are in the small road. It looks like just a uh, exact two lane. I hope that there's no so much car passing in this road. You know, I need to be wise using the electric of this bike because you know it's very long way for me to get to the next destination yeah maybe three four five hours that's why and at the moment i'm not using the electric because this is a flat surface and pedaling is easy i noticed that there are many 10 wheelers truck that are passing in this uh, road yeah less car Oh yeah, this is the Mayal River Camp, Primitive Riverside Camping, somewhere there. The name of this road is Mango Brass, if I'm not mistaken. This is uh, Mayal Lakes National Park. No domestic pets around. How come? There is also security cameras in this area. Wow. Oh, <laughs> the name of this street of this road is actually Mungo Brass, not Mango Brass. Yeah. Look at this, there is another Stewart and Lloyd's campground. Yeah, that is on that side. Yeah, there is always a place to stay if you are bikepacking or traveling around Australia. Finally, a sand dunes. Yeah, there's nothing much to see along the way because you know the road is uh, surrounded by trees. Yeah, that's why I don't really see so much. We are in the first stop and yes, yeah, usual this sea. And that island is the Broton Islands it says here yeah i actually driving coming from that side and there is that area and there is a way coming here and this is how it is yeah there's nothing much i just saw a guy with his dog walking around there and there are two cars in there and i think a two fishing guy yeah you see that car yeah they just finished fishing and they're going home See you later, Mike. Yeah, the name of the area is Hole in the Wall Picnic Area. No camping. Please remove all the rubbish. It is written there. Yeah, we keep on going. It is nice. There is no so much car. There are some big truck, 10-wheeler truck. And they are running past. Dangerous. I really get to the very side of the road whenever I see them coming. From time to time, I am seeing a way going to the beach on the other side there. Okay, so I just arrived here. I don't know, maybe this is the dead end or I am in the wrong way because it is like this. I didn't see this in the map. Yeah, let's check. I am maybe in the wrong way, but yeah, we, we check in the Google map or we check in the internet. Now I understand. And it, it is actually showing in the map. It's just that it is very small and I didn't see the details that there is a river. Yeah, so basically there is a ferry service that goes there every 30 minutes. Yeah, so we're going to wait for that ferry. And also it shows here how much is the price. If you have a car, it's $6.50. Caravan trailer 650. If you are just going to cross, two dollars. If you have motorbike, five dollars and fifty cents. And 
four tons and over ten dollars i am still feeling comfortable you know no sweat i am wearing this uh, snow jacket that i bought from aldi 39 dollars yeah five days ago yeah and this is nice it has a lot of features inside i will show you yeah and here there is a pocket here and there is also a pocket here will add actually comes with this to wipe the you know the glass yeah this is basically for snowboarding and the usual jogging pants that i am wearing and a new shoes coming from kmart 35 dollars yeah i thought that one is a stationary in there but that is actually the ferry at the moment there is car and it's now coming here awesome it's like a bridge but a ferry amazing it's a rope is holding to constantly moving it in there in the right way direction and look at those there are pelicans they are just standing by in there i hope that this road is similar to the one where i've been where there are not so much car and we are passing in this road it is not concrete this is just uh, soil and sand not the best place to drive amazing there is kangaroo <laughs> that's running i don't know if you can see but that one oh, already get inside yeah there is kangaroo <laughs> he was looking at me and then i saw him he saw me and he started to run okay finally we are in the concrete road yeah so good to drive yeah because you know previously there was uh, so much rock you know here in australia i've seen a lot of uh, ground like this but they don't plant anything it is just a playground of the animals like cow horses sheep yeah. there are so many cows on that side and you know i've noticed that there's no so much houses along the way yeah this is maybe this is just one of them yeah coming from a uh, tea garden yeah along the way i think i've seen maybe just five houses and there are no cars in here that it's beautiful and yeah, the grassland this is still wet of water I think we are now in Buladula because I am now seeing a lot of houses in here. I think we are near to the center. Okay, so right after uh, Tea Garden, this is the next town that I reached. The name is Buladila. I don't know which one is the center, but I think uh, not yet this one because it looks like a residential area, a mountain and there is a river here where I can see some white ducks. This maybe is just a park. Yeah, we stop here to eat something. We're going to eat this uh, caramel uh, protein bar. This is my jacket, I put it there. And I changed it with this uh, black one. This one is uh, more comfortable than that one. This one is uh, very, I mean, it's thick and heavy. Uh, yeah, it's midday, so yeah, the weather, the temperature is just right for this. And now we're going to look for a restaurant to eat. Buladella IGA. So I think this is already the center of Buladella. Yeah, the center of this town. As I can see, there are many restaurants here, and shop, and grocery. Yeah, and this in particular shop restaurant is nice. <music> 